only on nine. A Southland teenager is alive tonight thanks to his gaming headset. It deflected a stray bullet that blasted mm. through his bedroom window. Jonathan Gonzalez and his parents are still trying to process that close call. Pat and police are trying to figure out who fired that bullet. KKL 9's Rick Montanez is live in Harbor Gate Bay with the story you won't see anywhere else. Rick. Yeah, Pat and Juan, this is certainly an incredible story. This family counts itself fortunate, and while they still don't know where that stray bullet came from, they're now realizing how close they came to tragedy. This is the gaming headset that 18-year-old Jonathan Gonzalez says saved his life. You can see the damage. It actually bent this piece of metal right here, and it went through. Gonzalez is an active gamer. He was on his PlayStation the morning of April 1st, just after midnight, listening to music and chatting with friends when he felt something hit his head. It felt like if you're wearing a, like a bike helmet and someone just smacks the top of your head. He looked up and found a bullet hole in his bedroom window. The gunshot ripped his curtains down. After it struck him in the head, the bullet ricocheted against the wall and landed in his bed. If it wasn't for these on my head, I mean, it probably would have went through. He ran to his parents' room shouting he thought he'd been shot nearly two weeks later, and his family is still trying to process this close call. It's still a trigger yeah. for me to still process the thought that I could have lost my son. Um, we were asleep. Um, if it did hurt him, we would not have known until we woke up, you know, hours later. When LAPD responded, officers couldn't find the shooter. They don't believe the gun was fired at close range. Gonzalez's mom says even officers couldn't believe what happened. They were just as shocked. Gonzalez says he keeps thinking about how an inch in either direction could have changed things drastically. Minding my own business in my own room and I could have been gone, but I mean, just thinking about it for the first week, it just made me sick. Razor, the company that makes the headset, sent him a replacement. Gonzalez still loves to game, but he says he's now leery of what's happening outside his window. LAPD's Harbor Division is investigating the shooting, and while the Gonzalez family is hoping for an arrest, they tell me they are right now finding new ways to appreciate life a lot more. Live in Harbor Gateway, Rick Montanez, KCAL 9 News. A very lucky family, Rick, thank you.